Julie Roussel here tonight. And I wanted to ask you, you know, are you frustrated because you're not achieving your goals immediately? Are you wondering what it takes to be successful? And I heard this powerful story during a mentor's training and I wanted to share it with you. Maybe it'll affect you in the same way. Have you ever heard the story of the Chinese bamboo tree? I hadn't either, never before. <laughs> well, the Chinese bamboo tree is very, very different from other trees. It doesn't grow in a typical fashion. You know, like most trees that we have growing out in our yards, they grow in a very slow and steady fashion over a long, long period of time. Well, the bamboo tree is extremely different. Once you've planted it in the ground, it needs to be watered and fertilized every single day. That's right, every single day, if it's going to survive and grow. Now, I apologize, I am checking my notes to make sure that I get this right. So if I am looking down, I am checking out my notes. I can't possibly memorize all of this. But um, like I was saying, it takes literally four years of watering and fertilizing before it even breaks the ground. I mean, think about it. Every single day, watering, fertilizing, showing up every single day. You know, nothing. Year one, two, three, four, water, fertilize. Would you be able to show up for four years and see nothing as a result? I see more people are joining in. Hey, Joe, Kim, it's been a long time. But hey, for those of you joining in, if you have questions, feel free to pop them in the thread below. I'll try to answer them if I can. And let's get back to where I was before I forget my total train of thought. But um, in that fifth year with your Chinese bamboo tree, when you finally start to see something positive over the next six weeks, the bamboo tree will grow up to 90 feet. 90 feet. I mean, think about it. Does it take almost five years or six weeks just for that tree to grow? Oh, about five years. Now our lives, our careers, relationships, pursuing sports, goals, losing weight. You know, all of those are the exact same thing. Hey, Heather, thanks for joining in. It's been a while. But um, most of us, when we're working on our goals, you know, we work for weeks and years and months, and most of the time with no visible signs of progress. And then, bam. All of a sudden, one day, we've achieved our goal, we're successful. And then when we look back on that struggle, it doesn't seem like it was that difficult. You know, like the hardest workout you've been through. Oh, it really wasn't so bad, you say later. Well, that kind of struggle, like the bamboo tree, it requires a lot of faith. You know, the Chinese have that faith that if they just show up every day, you know, they water and fertilize, that eventually, that bamboo plant is going to grow. You know, they don't get frustrated after two years and say, oh, this isn't worth it. You know, I'm not sticking with this because I'm not getting anything out of this. No. You know, they have faith and patience, which are two very important things. Hey, I see more joining in. Great to see you, Donna. But um, if you have questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. I'll be happy to answer them. But like I was saying, we have to be willing, just like the Chinese, to show up and fertilize and wait for those results, as hard as that is. Hey, Jess. But we all want instant gratification. I mean, think about it. I want my results now, just like you do. You know, we all live in a microwave society where we want our results instantly, right now. You know, everybody says, I want a happy marriage, I want to lose weight, you know, I want to be a sports star. You know, I want my acne to clear up. I want to have more money. But most people aren't willing to pay the price to achieve that goal. You know, I've learned through 
my mentors that too much is given, much is expected. And that the price of that success is responsibility and most people aren't willing to bear that burden and pay that price. And that's where we go wrong. That's the hardest part for us. That's what keeps us from achieving our goals. Because if we're like most people, you know, we have this idea and we're so excited about it. You know, this dream that we have planted in our heads for ourselves. And we want it so badly. And we just can't wait for it to grow and to blossom and to see the results of our work. But we get discouraged when we don't see those immediate right now results. You know, we start to doubt ourselves and start to think that, well, you know, maybe I don't really have what it takes and, you know, I'm not really sure that it's worth it and I'm not sure I'll be successful. You know, and at that point, we then take our seed that we've planted and pick it up and try to take it somewhere else to plant it in a new location. You know, thinking that it's going to be different over in this new location. That maybe it's going to be easier to take care of that seed over there. And the hardest thing for me to realize was that it doesn't really matter where you plant your seed. And that in order for it to be successful, you have to water and fertilize it every single day. You know, if you think about it, we always say that the grass is always greener on the other side. But once you get to the other side of the fence, you still got to water and fertilize and mow the lawn for it to stay green. It's the same thing. But success that you want in any endeavor is going to be hard. I mean, make no mistake about it. You're going to be challenged every single step of the way. And if you, if you think the Chinese don't get frustrated after three years of constant watering and fertilizing without even seeing a tiny bit of a result, well, you're wrong. The determining factor in that tree growing would be you. It would be your willingness to engage in consistent action. And one of the other things that I learned from my mentor's training was that just one day, one day of not watering and fertilizing a little bamboo tree, that if you don't fertilize it for that every day, skip just one, and it dies. It, it dies. Just one day. I mean, think about it. So when you're working on achieving your goals, think, hey, it's just one day. It's just another step, good or bad. You know, and it really doesn't matter what the struggle is as long as you're still working on it. Now, I learned in this training that every single one of us, you too, has a bamboo tree inside of us. And that if we keep watering and fertilizing it, hey, Virginia, eventually you're going to see results. And as difficult and as exhausting as it may be sometimes and feel, it's worth it. You're worth it. And if you ask anybody who successfully planted their seed and reaped the benefits of the harvest, they're going to tell you that it's going to take hard work and patience. And success, whether it's in your career or relationship or sports, losing weight, you know, changing your skin, it doesn't really matter what it is. It rarely happens overnight and on our own timetable. It's going to feel like it takes forever. But once you reach that pinnacle, you're going to turn around to look back and it literally feels like it happened overnight, like your struggle was minuscule in comparison to the big picture. So if you have questions or comments on anything you heard, 
free to leave me a comment below. I'll be happy to answer. And if you know somebody who could benefit from hearing this message, feel free to share this video with them. So when you're struggling with working on your goals and you're not seeing immediate results, remember the story of the Chinese bamboo tree.